Hey, Andy Grant here, and I've got some mail. I've uh, I've got a letter I received uh, hmm, almost two weeks ago. I received this before Thanksgiving, and I've been hesitant to open it. So I thought I would open it on camera and make me really hesitant. <laughs> and it's weird. So I know who it's from. Um, it, it's from me. It's a self-addressed envelope from me to me. I wrote this at the New Warrior Training Adventure Weekend from the Mankind Project, which I did in late October. And we wrote letters to ourselves that would be mailed to us like 30 days later. This arrived, I believe, the day before Thanksgiving. Um, and today it's now December 2nd. Um, I looked at it a couple times. I knew it was for me. I don't remember what it says, but I've resisted opening it, um, which seemed kind of weird. I'm definitely not as... Uh, as as feeling high and just uh, psyched and not in my mind <laughs> as I was for really the whole probably first week at least, maybe two weeks after the new warrior training adventure. I've been kind of sick ever since Thanksgiving, feeling kind of a, a little bit low, um, but I've been resisting reading whatever I had to say to myself. So uh, here I go, resist no longer. And just so it, it's really sealed, I have no, I, I mean, I know it's from me, um, and again, I've, uh, I've, I've felt like hesitant to want to read my own words of wisdom or empowerment or whatever the hell I wrote. So, <sighs> Andy, <laughs> I, I'm already getting emotional just saying my name. This is really, wow. Okay, Andy. Remember the powerful insights and healing from the New Warrior Weekend forever. You realized again you are not alone. You truly realized you can trust and be supported by men, even by strangers. You saw the value you bring, the potential, and demand for real men feel. Your cathartic, powerful release around mom, dad, molestations, lies, trust, and love was huge and profound. The trust fall was like a rebirth, and falling into the arms of loving, smiling men was nothing short of astounding. Step up. Be bigger. Real men really do feel, and there are many, many more real men than you thought. <sighs> Remember the lose-lose scenario and go for what I want. Promote real men feel. Then there's things I can't read. <laughs> What does that say? Hmm. Online. Oh, complete online to be a man. Ongoing groups. Not sure what I'm saying there. You are powerful. You are loved. You are supported. And you are loving, supporting, and an authentic, vulnerable leader that men honor and respect. I love you. You are healed. You are more than enough. Signed, Andy, fun-loving chipmunk. P.S. Feel into deeper work with MKP. That's the Mankind Project. And I am exploring deeper work with them. So much energy talk this weekend. It isn't that different. More experiential and acting as if for releases. Do I want to be staff? That's a question I ask myself, and uh, the answer is yes. <laughs> Meet more men. Open up to more men. No, so many you judge as different, tough, not feelers, are feelers, and want to be more. You were born to be a leader. Cool. Well, that felt good. <laughs> that was that I had I I don't remember some of those things that it says to remember. The lose lose scenario. I'm gonna have to ponder about that. I remember the title of it. I have to like go back and maybe look at some notes to see what that was about. I think the scenario was as I progressed, um, thinking about what I want and thinking at the worst case scenario. Um, I was like set up for failure in both ways. Uh, going for what I want and failing left me in the same position as doing nothing, um, if I recall correctly. Um, then I'm, yeah. Something about, oh, completing online. All right, I know what that is. I have some online courses I've half made for men. But uh, awesome. I, I've, I don't think I've ever gotten a, a love letter from myself or a powerful empowerment reminder letter from myself. So uh, good job, me. <laughs> All right, so I got maybe uh, write to yourself. 
You know, what if uh, you had a new holiday tradition or a New Year's Eve tradition or something that you opened a letter that you wrote to yourself, you know, six months earlier or, you know, when you're really proud of yourself, um, when you're full of gratitude, when you're feeling so accomplished, write a letter and send it to yourself and don't open it for a while when uh, kind of when you've forgotten all about it. See if you can, you know, relight that magic that that you are and that you felt. Cool. All right. As always, be good to yourself. Bye.